What's up everybody, what's going on? Welcome back to the channel. I'm taping and I'm back at it again with another freaking video. So if you haven't already, make sure you guys hit that big subscribe button. Give this video a big thumbs up right now. Make sure you guys follow my social media. They always down in the description and they at the end of the video. You can't miss it. Please don't skip the video to the end to see my social media. You can just click the description, click that little thing, and you can see my social media is down below. Make sure you guys click that gray bell. Once you hit the subscribe button, get notified every time that I post a video. I post almost every day. Now that it's 2020, I'm back on my YouTube grind. I just want to say thank you guys so much for clicking on this video. If you want to see more videos, make sure you hit that subscribe button. But today, I'm coming to clutch with y'all. I'm posting back to back. To, I posted yesterday. Well, you guys gave this video yesterday. Well, I'm filming this video today. But just to make this easier. I'm, I'm filming this video on Jerry Ford. This video will be posted on the 5th because I already posted a video today. But I decided I was going to film two videos today so that it will be easier for me just to post tomorrow. So basically, I'm going to be doing an updated Q&A for 2020 that you guys asked for. So I asked about two days ago. For you guys to ask me questions on Instagram and I got quite a bit of questions so I'm gonna go through them and I'm gonna pick the best ones and we're gonna answer those I'm gonna be doing Q&A's all through the year because you guys want to know a lot of stuff about me and what I do and etc etc so let's just get right into the video the first question that I came across is what's your biggest goal for 2020 if you're talking about well honestly I have a bunch of goals my goals for 2020 for YouTube is to be more active and to reach 10k subscribers by the end of the year. Um, Instagram, I'm trying to hit 300k by the end of the year. It's probably not gonna happen, but you never know. I may go viral, lol. But um, my goal is honestly to become a better person. I'm, I'm already am a better person, but I want to become a better person and I want to actually make more money. I know it sounds like kind of weird, but I'm actually striving to make more money. So my goal is to be the best person I can be in any many possible ways as possible. Like I want to inspire more people. I want to grow a bigger fan base. I want to do meet and greet soon and all that type of stuff. So I'm just waiting for my time to come. I just feel it coming. It's 2020, a better opportunities. You know what I'm saying? The next question is, what made you start dancing on Instagram? Well, when we started dancing on Instagram, it's honestly when Musical.ly died down. I honestly took a long break after Musical.ly, after my page got taken down off Musical.ly with over 64,000. I was so close to being like up there, up there, but I guess it was not meant for me to be on there. But I'm back on TikTok with 6K, so I mean, it's not really about the followers, but having a fan base with support is honestly the best thing in the world because I've learned that the easy way because Instagram is just a really big platform with a bunch of people that support you. And it's just, it's overwhelmingly, it's just all around just the most important thing to me. I literally get up in the morning and think about you guys all the time. Like, oh my God, I gotta post a dance video. And like the days that I miss, like I miss like a whole two weeks and I'm like, oh my God, my page is gonna be active, but you guys stay strong. Like you guys always gonna be there for me. And I feel like if I were to take a thousand, a thousand day break, LOL, I'm over exaggerating. But if I were to take like a long, long, long break, you guys will still be there because my gang is strong. We strong, y'all, we strong. Question is, what's your idea of a perfect day? My idea of a perfect day is actually doing something with yourself and not staying in the house all the time. Me, I'm always out and about, but when I'm when the days that I'm home, I just feel like there's nothing really to do. So basically, going out with friends, spending time with family is a perfect day. Basically, something that make that puts a smile on your face is a perfect day for me. Like even the simplest things of not just being in the house is a perfect day. So I feel like. Anything that makes you smile, it's a perfect day. Next question is, what sport do you like the most? I just, I don't know. I like all time, I play every sport almost, just about every sport, but as of right now, my favorite sport is basketball. It's been basketball for a while now, but I used to love baseball a lot. I played baseball for like four and a half years, five and a half years, one to two, and I was actually really good at it. I don't know why I didn't try for high school, but fun fact, I used to play baseball and I'm really good at it still to this day. But, um, yeah, I think I'm digging basketball as of right now. The next question is, would you ever have a meet and greet? I just talked about this. You guys just saw about it. But I'm planning to do a meet and greet very, 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 very soon. As soon as possible. It's probably the next five or six months. But I'm trying to figure out places to do it. I live in Florida, but it's like a part of Florida that nobody really lives in. And I feel like that's like what every well-known people is like. Always like, oh, my God, I have nowhere to do it. Da -da -da -da, certain people, but... 
I mean, I probably would do it, but it'll probably be a mini one. It probably wouldn't be a big one because I'll probably have to go out of state because not many not many people live in Florida that are my followers, but I'm not sure. I'm going to do a poll soon. But, um, yes, my goal this year is to actually do a meet and greet. I just want to um, have fun, make dance videos, bond, take pictures with you guys because I feel like there's not too many influencers and dancers that do that often. Like, a lot of them are bougie, no shape, though I'm being 100% honest. Like, when I was down low and I didn't have no followers, no clout, whatever you want to call it. But, um... <clears throat> I got treated that way so I mean it's from experience but it's cool though I promise you I'm not like that but I really do want to do a meet and greet soon definitely this year so guys be on the lookout for that I'll probably post updates on YouTube if so um yeah so just stay tuned next question is what type of vibe do you say you give off um I'm a real chill goofy person a lot of people find me hilarious I'm just I don't know um yeah, I'm real hilarious if you actually be around me for a long time, but I know on YouTube I'm like proper or what a lot of people say I am, but I'm really not. I'm just bored. <laughs> and look, I just enjoy making videos for you guys because I know you guys enjoy watching them, but if you don't, then don't watch them. LOL. But uh, I give out a real chill, goofy vibe. I also can be, <clears throat> people say I can also be, uh, I really don't know. But a lot of people say I'm just funny and chill to hang around. I can come off of be being mean sometimes when people get on my nerves or like it don't go my way like a certain way. But it's not in a good way. Most of the time, it's not in a bad way I meant to say. But most of the time I'm pretty chill and I'm on my business because I don't really talk to people at school. Honestly, I really don't. I just say what's up to the people that I really mess with. The other people I'm just like, or... Hey, Cause you know, I'm not just going to let somebody speak to me. I'm not speak back because I just, that type of person, I'm just chill like that the next question is how long are you gonna have your braces on honestly i don't know i haven't been in the i haven't been to the orchard Islands in about four or three months i'm actually ready to get my colors changed i've had these since may i've kept these same colors i don't know why i haven't changed them i've just been used to these colors but i feel like if i do change my colors i'm not gonna be used to it but you know it's whatever braces is braces no one's gonna hate on me i'm still king Teddy. i'm just playing but <laughs> um <clears throat> i was supposed to have them on for two years I'm supposed to have them on for two years, but February 15th will make a year. 2019, February 15th, I got my braces on. You guys know if you like looked at my old videos, but I archived them because they were really embarrassing and ugly, but <laughs> they're not on there anymore. But basically, it's a new year. February 15th of this year will make a year that I've had my braces on. Um, They said my, I'm making really good progress in my teeth, so, uh, yeah. Hopefully, I can get them off when they say two years or maybe before that but I feel like I'm making progress too because my teeth are straight but I still have a lot to do with my bottom my tops are straight but my bottoms are just absolutely messed up <laughs> next question is would you ever go somewhere or like on a trip where would it be <clears throat> basically I really want to go well, when I graduate I want to go to Bora Bora um that's really what my mindset is for because that's why I'm trying to save up my money now <clears throat> because I feel like after graduation is going to be, I don't know, I'm, I'm really not sure what it's going to be like because I'm not a senior yet, I'm a sophomore and I have so much other things to be thinking about. But um, I would really want to go to Bora Bora but like if it was like a family trip or something like that, I really want to go to LA because there's so many opportunities and there's so other so much there's so many opportunities and so much other things to do there also Atlanta Georgia is actually a big platform for the entertainment business and that's the business that I want to be in when I get older but <clears throat> my top top like trip is to go to Bora Bora when I graduate so that is definitely on my agenda for <clears throat> 2022 when I graduate so yeah all right guys that's it for today's video i didn't want it to be too long i just wanted you guys to have a relaxed enjoyable q a video that you guys asked for thank you guys so much for watching i honestly appreciate everybody's support and that you guys been like you guys been hecka crazy with the likes and everything on instagram it's been amazing this year already um i told you guys i'm gonna be active on youtube i hope you guys are enjoying the back-to-back -back uploads if not please unsubscribe because i am telling you i'm not gonna stop posting videos this year but anyway thank you guys so much wish you guys leave a big like 100 if this video gets 80 likes i'll drop another video the day after tomorrow so uh 
yeah make sure you guys leave a like and comment not comment DM me on instagram uh what videos did you guys want to see on my channel video suggestions are always a good thing for me because now that i know that you what you guys want to see that when you guys tell me what video suggestions that you guys want on my channel that i can film them for you guys to get them out there so yeah thank you guys so much for watching i'll see you guys in the next one peace